Hey guys, it's Chuck Connor. Welcome back for more Mother 3. All right, in the last part, we saw Salsa and Samba running away from us because they did not recognize with the pig mask on. They were being trapped in the Camara Lab. They, apparently, they wanted to do something with them. We got to find out what. But before it, we better get Salsa back on our side again. So let's go ahead and go look for him again. Huh, what's going on? Look out! An almost Mecha lion. It's not fully me Mecha, as you can see by its face. Uh. The almost mecha lion. It's a kind of a tough boss fight, actually. I gotta say that much. Uh, it's a bit tough, but something that a lot of people don't know about this boss fight is it doesn't matter if you kill it or not. No matter what, the same thing happens. The only thing you're gonna lose out on if you get a game over on this fight is the experience. The same thing will happen in the story, whether you win or lose. So really, it doesn't matter. It's one of the very few fights in the game where you can die and it won't make a difference, but it is totally possible to win. Alright, uh, Boney, looks like you're just attacking. Come on! Come on, you beautiful hedgehog! What the hell? God, I am... Ah, uh, God, I wasn't really so great in the last part that I recorded, though, but in this part, oh my God, I'm saying the weirdest crap. Oh, crap, speaking of... Speaking of crap, I better heal. Wait. Speaking of crap, I better heal. That doesn't make any logical sense. Eh, never mind. It doesn't have to make sense, because it's a Let's Play! <laughs> Jeez. So yeah, I've uh, been playing quite a bit of Beautiful Katamari. If you guys are friends of mine on Xbox Live, you would know that. Oh, 82. Um, but yeah, it's pretty damn cool, really. I'd recommend it. I mean, it's... I can kind of see where people are coming from saying it's the weakest in the series, though, but Beautiful Katamari is still really good. I mean, the main theme song is damn cool. I got it in my favorites, actually, if you guys didn't notice. Yeah, I'm, I'm just, I'm really breaking the fourth wall here, not really talking much about the game. Because there, there isn't much to talk about. This boss fight really doesn't have a whole lot of variety. I mean, it's got a poisonous tail that can poison you, though, but that's really about it. Um... I'm a horrible lp -er. I can't stay on the subject of the game. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. Alright, come on. Come on! Die! Could you please die for me? Oh, jeez! <laughs> I like that. That That is exactly why I equip that item that defends against fire, but doesn't have as high defense. Because of that. And because of other fire enemies later in the game. And it is done. We got level 34, and Boney, come on, grow level. Nah, Boney didn't get a level, because he sucks. Huh. He's back for more. A clay guy saved our life! The clay guy is the Matrix! Are you okay, cute part-timer? Ew, he called us cute? How many are left? Just one now. The one? You mean the red one with the huge mouth? Yeah. That thing means serious trouble. Standing here won't solve anything. For now, let's hurry and seal the exits. Watch yourselves, guys. Uh oh. That doesn't sound good, if it was stronger than this one. Hey, cute part-timer, there's actually one more that's still lurking around here somewhere. One that's way more dangerous than the one just now. Uh-oh. If, while looking for the monkeys, you happen to see a red thing with a gigantic mouth, GET THE HECK OUT OF THERE! Well said. Listen, pay close attention now. If you run into a red giant mouth chimera, do absolutely nothing to it. Got that? I've warned you. And while I'm warning you like this, I should add a little extra. There's even more dangerous not to take time out to, with the, to talk with the frogs. Alright, be careful now. For those of you who have played Super Smash Bros. Brawl, you probably already know what is going on here, and if there's any of you guys who are watching this who haven't played Super Smash Bros. Brawl, I feel very sorry for you. <laughs> okay. It's a stuffed frog, but it still saves. Nice. 
There are many unidentified objects here, all preserved in formaldehyde. Full bodies of animals, large and small, are being preserved in chemicals. You get the feeling staying in here for too long will make you lose your appetite. There's no item in here? I just there was an item in here. That's the whole reason I came in here, not just for that line of dialogue. Oh well, let's just get the heck out of- whoa. A Dragosaurus skeleton.